Hey guys, it's Johnny, johnnyarmani.com. Today I am doing a breakout of a Western Digital hard drive that is in a case that needs to be taken out. So let's just say you've had one that's like completely broken down, you want to get into this thing. I've got a cool product here that I'm going to be using in the next segment, which I'll break this into two parts. It's called an Inatech. And basically what it is, it's a adapter that hooks to a hard drive. So you may think your Western Digital drive is actually dead, but the reality is, is that it's probably not dead. It's probably just the power source in here that's just out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to crack this thing open. If you, ha if you have one of these and it's sitting around, chances are the drive is still good. And what you're going to use is this product called Inatech, and I just bought one. I'm testing it out for the first time. And I'm going to open this thing up, and then I'll make part two so you can see how it works. So first you're going to grab a screwdriver. And we're going to pry the sides open right here on each of these sides right here, if you can kind of see it. So there are no screws on this. And be careful with the hard drive because once you start getting into this thing, and I'm just going to bust this thing out because I'm not going to actually use this case again because the power, the power side is actually dead. So this thing just slides right off. Pretty cool. So here's your hard drive right here. And you're going to use, if you can kind of see in there, there are one, two and this little funky adapter right here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pull this hard drive out, which is perfectly good. And this is like, I think a two terabyte or a one terabyte hard drive. So this has all my information on it, but the, the power source that is this little box right here is toast. So we're gonna replace this. We're gonna hook it to this Inatech box, this adapter, and I'll be able to use this drive and put it in a brand new case that you can pick up on like eBay or Amazon. I'll put a link in the box down below so that you can take a peek at one of those if you need one, or you can just hook this in a tech straight to the hard drive and plug it into a power source and use it literally just as it sits right here. So let me pull this thing out and then I will be right back. Okay, so what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna break off this little plastic piece that's actually just kind of clipped on here. It's like a little clip that's kind of sitting in the hard drive. Then what we're gonna do is we are going to take these pieces right here and this is going to slide down just pull it right out it's literally it comes out like butter you just kind of tilt this thing out and the hard drive comes right out so at this point we don't need the power supply anymore which you can see is plugged into the uh the sata adapter right here so what we're going to do is we are going to undo this little bad boy right here Take those two screws off and then pull it backwards like that and then it's unplugged. So what's happened is this piece right here, this little board, is actually plugging into, if you can kind of see it, it plugs into the data connector of your drive. So we're just, this thing's junk, it's toast. You could probably buy a new one, but at this point you can pick up a drive that's, you know, a whole new drive that's uh, all put together for, you know, 90 bucks. So now we got the hard drive. So now all we got to do is we can take this bracket piece off if we want to. I'm actually just going to leave the bracket on um, and use the, the data connector to this. So in the next video, I'll show you exactly how to adapt the adapter, plug it into a USB port, and we'll see if this drive works. I actually haven't tested it, so we're going to find out. Okay, so now that you've got your hard drive out, we're going to use the Inatech, which is a USB 3.0 to IDE to SATA converter. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this little bad boy off right here, and I'll do this off really quickly. This is the bracket that the Western Digital hard drive came out of, and we are just going to pop all of these screws off real quick. I probably should have used a drill, but, you know, I need some hand muscle bodybuilding type like exercise so all right almost done last screw and you know what recycle this if you want to it's just a brace so now what we got is we've got the connector right here which is where the power adapter went inside the box that went bad so now what we're going to do is we're going to take our Inatech which comes in this fancy little box and each side has a different connector for a different different side um, so you can put three different hard drives on this. So this is pretty slick. So we're going to use this one right here. I don't know if you can see it. We're going to match it up to here. And this thing right here plugs something like, just like that. Is that pretty slick or what? So basically it takes the place of that little box. So now what we're going to do 
is it comes with a driver, so you can use the driver uh, in your computer for whatever Mac OS you're using, whether it's Windows. Come, and then it comes with a power adapter. So the power adapter is going to plug into the backpack here. So you've got your power adapter. Let's just say for the sake of I have a power, I plug it into the wall. Then you're going to hook this piece up right here to your USB, which goes back here. So there's this little special port. This is a special adapter that comes with it. So it's kind of it looks like it's kind of proprietary. So this little bugger goes into here. Looks like a big wired mess, it's not so bad. And then this, of course, just plugs straight into your computer, and we're gonna see if this works. So I'm gonna go plug it in. Okay, so now you've got your stuff plugged in, you've got your hard drive plugged in with your Inatech. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna hook the USB port. So I've got this hooked to the power, hooked to the hard drive, I've got the USB hooked in, so now I'm gonna plug this into my Mac, into the USB drive, just like that, somewhere in there. And we're gonna see what happens. So now we gotta press power. Okay, so you see this little blue light at the bottom down here is lit up. So let's see if this shows up on my hard drive. I'm gonna try and move this camera up just a little bit so you can see it. So now let's go into our, let's go into our drive and see if this hard drive is actually worthless or not. Do you want to start operating system? Don't use. Okay, so here's the deal. So believe it or not, there's the drive, and it works fantastic. So the drive, my two 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 ter two gigabyte hard drive, uh, two terabytes. I don't know what the heck it is. Anyway, it works. It's fantastic. So check this thing out. It's by Inatech. I'm going to grab the box. I'll put the link in the description for you and you can check it out to support me. I would love it if you just click through the link. It gives you a little bit of a discount. And I appreciate you watching. Stay tuned for my next video. And you guys have a wonderful one. If you, I'd love for you to hit the subscribe button. Any comments would be fantastic. You guys have a great one. Bye.